Hey everyone, it's me, the Order, coming at you live. Well, not really live, but this is edited, kind of. Um, we're going to talk about Torchwood, the death of Harry Potter, and other things with my friend Connie. See you guys then. <laughs> Perfect level. Hold on, get my coat. Ah, yeah. All right. So basically, what Kenny and I tried to do first take was to do everything awesome, and then my computer decided not to record anything. Uh, hi. Hi. So we were going to talk about Harry Potter and Torchwood and all that cool stuff, and then I realized it was eight minutes, and then it didn't record anything. I'm upset. Yeah, I'm figuring. Yeah. This is Connie, by the way. She's on her phone because her Skype doesn't work and everything on her computer doesn't work. And no camera. So, instead, I, this is her in, in essence. I, I've captured her essence inside of a phone, and there she is. Hello. Yes. So, but levels are high, kind of. Okay. So... Let's make it trying to brief, and also, if this doesn't work, I can still get the audio from my other camera. Hello, other camera. Yes. Yes, hello, other camera. Okay. <laughs> so, yeah, really quick. Torchwood, good, bad, evil, because it's in America. Um, in the middle. It depends on how they end up running it. Because it's not 100% British-y? Yes? Yeah. Ah. Most British shows, when they hit America, they kind of... Like being human, perhaps. Pretty much. Yeah. I've seen the first two episodes. It looks pretty good, only because Russell T. Davis wrote the first episode. That's it. Yeah. Moving on, Harry Potter. What are you going to do after part two? Well, I've already seen it. I saw it on opening night. Um, oh. I haven't. Uh, I'm not going to do any spoilers, but I'm going to be a good girl. Okay. Um, Because he's been doing that so successfully as of late, because of showing girls off his uh, penis. So that was that was so classy. Yeah, we're, uh, we, as a generation, are gonna miss him because we literally grew up with them. Um, from what I'm hearing, the girl who plays Hermione, her name is not coming to me right now. Um, yeah, that. Oh, because I heard she was in a music video recently. She was. Yeah. Um, actually, I'm watching this video as we speak. Ah. Um, and she's editing a video, by the way, guys. So keep that in mind. And, computer, yeah, you better I'm, record I'm, this. I'm editing a video for the best I could possibly do under current circumstances. Yeah, just post it on my thing. That's cool. Uh, we have three minutes, so we have three minutes to go. This is cool. Actually, we have extra time. This is amazing. By the way, guys, why do you think my glasses reflect into the screen partially? Because it does. Um, further point. <laughs> yes. Uh, do you think that the reason why they have to bring yes. politics into it, but, um, what do you think about Casey Anthony getting away with it? Um, I don't know because they didn't have enough evidence into it and I was really confused because I'm the kind of yeah but um 
I don't know. I mean, like, I, I, all I know is what Sexy Phil tells me. Um, I agree with you, I, I agree with you, it's just, uh, I don't know, all of our friends were nice and stuff, and I'm like, well, if Sexy Phil is upset with it, I'm, I'm not going to touch it. Yeah. Um. Um. Yeah. Okay. Um, moving more positive things, since Doctor Who is in the... Was gonna start again in October. I'm like, hmm. And then I started realizing one thing about Doctor Who that I never thought about before because my mom was watching it last night. Okay. Um, Doctor Who is really, really British. You what? Yeah, I know, but like, I'm starting to look at Matt Smith's nose. It's really almost pushed in, you know? Yeah, and, and she was watching the one with Venice, and I was like, yes, and? And he's like, don't you see what you're doing? You are murdering these people! And he's like, so British about it. I'm like, okay, and? And then I started realizing, wait, hold on. You've just killed so many people, and now you're going to murder all of the rest of them by pushing them into the ocean? Okay, couldn't you just dump them in the water like you did with the everyone else? And she's like, no, that would be practical. And I'm like, and then you give the doctor time to save everyone. What? Yeah, that's the one thing I really don't get about people that are supposed to be supervillains. Yeah, they, they, they give... give the superhero time to save the person. Yeah, I mean, if you always a supervillain, I'd be like, no, doctor, no, you do not have time to save them. I've already done it by the time you try to figure it out. I, I, it's not that practical. I don't know. Ugh. Step bad. Okay. So, we're exactly at six minutes now. I don't want to overdo it, but, uh, Connie, you have important news to tell them. Go ahead and, and go crazy. Uh, well, there'll be a video out for me soon, but under current circumstances, I haven't been able to post one. Um, all of you guys uh, still will continue to be awesome, I hope. Um, and I'm going to sign off. Uh, so I'll talk to all you guys later. Okay. Keep an eye out for my videos. Uh, DFTBA. All right. See ya. Bye. Okay. See you later, cons. Okay. So I am being knocked at the door right now. I need to get going. So I will talk to you guys later. See ya. Peace out, Girl Scouts. Ding.